Hi guys, so first of all, back up your disk before partitioning it. Run bootcamp assistant and click on continue. Now, if you want, download the Windows support for your Mac and burn it on a CD or DVD or choose, like me, the second option. I prefer that Windows uses only 50 GB of my hard disk. Therefore, I click on Partition. After that, insert your install DVD and click on Start Installation. Windows starts the installation and now you have to choose, like you know, language and keyboard configuration. Then click on Install Now. It's important to select Bootcamp Partition. Click on Drive Options. Therefore, Format Bootcamp Partition. And click on Next. Complete the installation, inserting your name, password and uh, the product key. Set up the updates, time and date settings and finally you have Windows in a bootcamp partition. Now you must install Windows support. Insert in your DVD player the disk you burn it or like me the Mac OS installation DVD and run setup. After the bootcamp installation you can reboot your system and use Windows with Mac drivers. Now as you can see I have a bootcamp volume, Windows formatted, with about 15 GB of space. If you want to choose which disk, therefore the operative system, you want to use to start your computer, open System Preference and click on Start Up Disk. Select Mac OS X or Windows. I select Mac OS. If you want to choose manually a different operating system, turn on the Mac and push Alt key. I choose, for example, Windows. And Windows starts. I restart my MacBook and Snow Leopard starts. Like you remember, I chose it in my startup disk preference. I turn on the Mac without push any key. If you want to remove 
the bootcamp partition, run bootcamp assistant, select create or remove a windows partition and click on restore. Insert your password and click on OK. That's all. Bye bye.